Hello, Hello guys, this is Sony Freak. This is Chosage. Well, basically, if you notice who that is, yeah, basically I have to create him because it's annoying to have to create someone who's not actually in the game. But yeah, I have created Jose Mourinho. What I'm going to do is, uh, is this. I'm going to sort his tactics, tact the way he like this tactics. And I will help PSG, see what will PSG will look like under Jose Mourinho. If she's going to help PSG to win the Champions League under him. Same thing I did with the Pep Guardiola one, I'm gonna do the exact same thing, but with the signs that Joseph will bring him himself. The type of place he likes. The type of place like he could turn into that team into Champions League winners. Maybe win the travel. I don't know. But we'll see you guys in a minute. Hello guys, um these are the players I have signed. Fishy sign from other clubs. John Mario from Benfica, I have signed them for a 28.9 million pound and it's a 177,000 pound weekly wages. Then I've ordered Gene Sancho from Manchester United, his value, well, we signed him for 47.1 million pound and he is, his wages is 110 million. Not 110, 5 million, 110,000 pounds, I meant to say. Next was Edson Alvarez, 28.8 million pounds from Ajax. And he is, his weekly wages is 49.5 thousand pounds. Pellegrini from Roma, we signed him for 46.7 million pounds. And he is, his weekly wages is 81,000 pounds. And I know you guys gonna put this in the chat. Why did I why did I did this? Easy. I didn't just did something no one has seen before. I have swap what of my own players for Harry Maguire because maybe because I could sell Maguire. Help man, you know, get finally get with my, a player like Maguire, swapping them for a bad player. And that was Prince, Prince Nel Kempembe as well. Now he has joined Manu from a swap plus cash deal. And yeah, basically, I signed Harry Kane for Harry, Maguire, Harry Maguire for £14.3 million with a swap deal for him. I did manage did have an F run when it was basically I was only one minute down, like a less of one minute less it should be, but sign them less one minute less. I have that they should be B or D or C, not F, but yeah. Alright, Luke Shaw, I have brought them as well for 29 million pound, and his weekly wages is 105,000 pound. And I brought in another centre back only because I need a player who could play as a left centre back who can't a left footed alongside Maguire or Ramos basically. And yeah, and that's why I signed in, signed, brought in David Alaba from Real Madrid for £57.5 million. Pound. I'm going to show you guys the player who has officially left the club. I tried to get on this bet, but I couldn't find all the shows the other. Not one player who's got transfer list so who's going for in from another team on a loan with Bayern Shop on on this deal, but I've showed the player who is all has been sold. Here's the guys the names has been sold. First one was sold for straight away was Messi. Yeah, I did have some two of about well, two deal came in for him, but I managed to sold Messi to Man City. I did have one on Chelsea but they wouldn't swap me with one of the other players I didn't want to. Then it was Juventus. Thing was Juventus won the Messi, and that team came team went well. Cause I'm, I stick with the price I think you should be. Is that fifty mil? But a man just came for forty seven point four because it's Pep anyway. But yeah, Neymar has joined Inter Milan for eighty eight point eight million pound. 
Ferrati has joined Juventus at 88.3. Now these two are going against each other in the Serie A. Uh, b -b -b He's going on loan for 12 months. McCurney has joined Real Madrid for 1.2, 1.1.2 million pounds. Some of was F, really, but yeah. And that's it. That's the player who has been sold to another joint, another club, basically. And I have got enough for January transfer window. I'm not going to spend big in this window, but I'll probably be spending big in the next window. I have basically got... Hold on. It's in office, not transfer. It's in office. Basically, I haven't but basically got 257 million pounds, but I might just keep some in the one side towards the next window. But... I'm going to skip the whole matches. I have been skipping some of the games. I haven't played them. I've skipped them. I've seen them. I didn't want to play any of those matches until we do well. If somehow, somehow Mourinho does well and his team actually turn it into a Champions League winners, win the league, win a trophy, and yeah, we just see. Hello, guys. Um, I've skipped the whole for the whole calendar year. Well, for the last year's I say calendar year um uh, from from September but all the way to now and we are basically we second we are only a three point behind we only draw uh, lost two games we draw six games so we won eleven games but not that actually that bad because our next game is against Lil really and Lil's in sixteen we should be able to win this next match, really. If Marseille loses the next match, I don't know about that, but if they do lose us, then yeah, maybe we should be lucky actually win in the next game, really. But let's check on the Champions League. Uh, hold on. Let's start from from A to down. The winners, the two teams going through their group A is Liverpool and Napoli. With 30 points and 9 points. Both Ayers and Rangers going to the U. One of them got to the U. But you think the other one will be in the U. But Conference League. I think. Porto is through. With Club Rouge. Let. Fucking hell. Let the call be beaten. By Club Rouge. For the running ups. In the group B. Okay. Bayern Munich has. PC the winning of that group. In group C. And Barcelona the run ups, but you know, you're like, like last season, Barcelona were not the winner of the group, so not a run ups. They were <sighs> lost and they got knocked out in the Champions League, they got into the Uber League, and they had to play against my United, and we beat the Barcelona! Yeah, <laughs> Spurs. Basically, when they lose, they haven't lost one single game. Six C points, they only drop once. Most Marseille is in second. They're basically the running ups in Group D. Chelsea are the winners of their group with 13 points. Joint 13 points with AC Milan. Basically, Milan, AC Milan is the only Italian team that's going through in the Champions League knockout stages and enters in the Champ Europa League. We legit, of course, they would. Won all their games, except they draw one. Have lost in one single, they have 60 points in the Champions League. Group F. And after, like, Psych is busy in the run ups as well, in start with 12 points. Manchester City, of course, has, hasn't lost one single game, 16 points. They draw one match. And Borussia Dortmund is busy second. And they are through, basically, by goal differences. And Paris Saint-Germain has lost one game, draw once, and we have 60 points in the Champions League group stage, Group H. Uh, who is our first game in the National Coupe National? Oh, not yet. Alright, what about this one? Truth Champs. Paris Saint-Germain being FC Nats for 4-1. Right guys, I'm going to basically pause record, stop this recording, 
I'm gonna make some signings. Hopefully, this, these type of signings could help PSG to win. To actually get that like, comeback to win in the League One, the Champions League, the National Cup, you know, whatever it's called. And, and yes, let's see what happens next. I've signed someone for Dortmund. And you could see it, you could tell. Jubel has joined PSG. You soon find how much it is. I can't remember it was. Yeah. But yeah. It wasn't a lot, but yes. Yeah, eighty seven point nine million pounds. Ah, see, I thought it'd be an A. Forty seventy four point eight. Okay, matter. We could squad that full suit together. I know so, I know so. I think these both blows will be perfect together. But yeah, that's one that I have signed, guys. There's more to come. Hey uh, guys, um, now I have made, I have made three signings. Marco Sensi from Real Madrid for a VR value of 40.4 million pounds. And his contract was on 135,000 pounds weekly wages. Drew Benham was £87.9 million pound, and his wages was basically £38,500 and Evan Ferguson from Brighton he has joined the cup on the deadline day signed him on a three, basically £3 million pound and £13,000 weekly wages and I think the only player who has officially left the cup hold on It was Pereira. Ramos gonna be on the free transfer anyway. He still be at the club until the end of the season. It was basically a pre-season contract. Uh, he left on a loan and that's that basically. Basically, two players left and three and obviously Ramos not yet until the when his contract expires end of the year, end of the transfer, end of the deal. End of the season, that's when his contract will expire. Yeah. I'm gonna skip the few other matches, guys. I hopefully we do pretty well in the league right now. Right? But what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show where we are now currently in the league before I skip the whole thing. Basically. We are currently in first against Marseille. No. Currently first in the league go one Uber East League. Alright. And the Champions League we are going against Milan, EC Milan, right? I'm gonna skip the whole game of the seasons guys. Um one below. Alright guys, we are PC on the end of the season now. I got a surprise coming up next. After I done Nunes, we are the League One champions. We have retained our title this season. Like, remember I've, when I did Pep, we have lost. We came short against Lyon, but this time out, we have retained our title. All right. Then at the Cuba National, we in the finals against the the Rams. And I probably will be playing that match as well, but this is not a surprise. The surprise will go in to happen when I start recording, I will record again. And I'll be doing it in the next match coming. Is this not it? Nope, it's not it, but something else. We achieve one hour goals by waiting by 
One goal is this. Win the league. We are I'm trying to tag and win the trouble and the Jersey Mourinho within one season. Not two, not three, not four, not five, but one season. One season. If I'm able to do that, winning the one thing that Paris Saint-Germain has never won before under the right manager, you guys know why. But let's do it, do it. <laughs> That would be a good goal, that one then.
Son That was a free kick to me. But now everyone favors Barcelona. Fucking hate the team. I hate the flipping players mean it. Nah, I'm being to I'm being to for freaking out. Barcelona shouldn't be allowed to sign any players when they're in debt. They should pay that debt off. But no. Yes!
Champions League winners, Paris Saint-Germain. Well, this is what they wanted. What's a moment for these players? They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. After all, to reflect on the final that so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. That's two trophies down, guys. Two trophies are down. One more, we could win the treble. Actually, no, we could win the quadruple in France. One more trophy guys and I'm not playing that next game because obviously the length of the recording will be But yes, we won the Champions League. One more trophy is left Want well, guys, let's see who can actually win it. Let's see we can win the win the draw win one more trophy in our hands Oh by the way, I have rest some of those actually no my bath is still moved. It's still playing here. Get in there, Paris. Get in there, Killian. Sancho. So with the game, to admire about PSG, really on the Come on! So back in business here, and PSG dominating the proceedings in the first half. Will we see a similar pattern in the second quarter? I'm going to soon in the back, guys. I'm going to just jump in when the. What? No. Holding up the trophy. Sanchez. 
different ball every day of the week. Ten minutes left for play. Ghana. The cup issue is settled. Trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team, and now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren. My suckers. <laughs> That's all the shows it has been one. Let's go through the standings of the league, the other competitions we will end and one. First we have the league champions. Power to eighty seven points. Then we won the before the league started we won the trophy jump. And we won by against FC Nant. Then obviously we in, then we have one that I'm um, in the possible for Paris Saint Germain. One in winning the UEFA Champions League. Impossible that that they couldn't do so well, they mean for so. And then the last and not all the way no yeah. The last not no least winning one more trophy. Then they chose his first season as manager who held helped Power Central Man to get to win the league, win the Champions League, winning this and winning the trophy jump and then the Champions League. He has turned this side as the king of the world and the best team in the world ever. Paris Saint Germain. Guys, hit the like button, comment below what team should, what team and what manager should I do next? 
And also, I will do also, I want you to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Sonic Free, Sonic Free Gaming. Follow me on my Twitch, Sonic Free Gaming. And my other social media links will be in the description below. I hope you guys enjoy this. And really, is, it was frustrating that actually wins one of the main match. I want to try to win, not lose. Because I know I can come on this and it's like a, quite a while to record and edit it and I can't be out doing that. But yes, we have won the quadruple. See you guys next time. See the Sonic Week. I'm your king on games. You should acknowledge me. See you guys next time. Chaos Control!